Hi guys, let's automate table coordinate and export to MX Excel by leaves in this short video. Then you come to your command line, type app enter, load the leaves, load it, click on close. When you load it, come to your command line, you type C O O R. Here it is, you click on that. Then you specify the first point, which is the first coordinate point, you click on that. Then you specify the second point, which is the second pillar point, you click on that. Then you click on the enter start point, which I want it to start from number one. Then you click on enter. Then you specify the upper left corner of the table, so you can choose to use any corner of your work environment. Then you are going to see the table displayed. And here it is, point eastern northwest. The circuit is appearing here, so I'm just going to use this window to be showing you how the coordinate is displayed and come to this viewport here then the next thing is to enter the next point so you click on the point 3 you can see it is showing here point 4 so you keep on doing for the rest of your pillar points this is really good for layout uh, coordinate extraction And when you are done with the last pillar point, you click on enter on your keyboard. Then you are going to see the whole table shown from point 1 to point 2. I'm just going to change it to single pot. Then I am quickly going to export it to MXSL format by coming to the command line. You type EPP, click on enter. Then you load the table exports to lips file. Click on load, click on close. Then you come to your command line, you type CE. Then you are going to see the command here you click on that then you select the table that is automated then you click on enter so you can just come below here you are going to see it spotted in excel format and that is how to use a auto leaves file to extract coordinates from autocad to excel easily thank you for watching do wait to check under the description to see the full video on how to go about it step by step if you missed out on any step thank you see you in the next video